Welcome to Rhinos and Aliens. It's about concussions. <laughs> and how they're linked to limp dick. You get a concussion, your dick starts just limping. It sounds like it start leaning and shit like, oh fuck. No. <laughs> I, I was just I was saying that'd be funny, but it's, it's erectile defunction. Erectile dysfunction. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Okay, so there is uh there there is an article. Well, there's many articles, but there is a survey. A study done. Former American football players who suffered concussions mm-hmm. are more likely to get limp dick than a person who did not suffer concussions. Now, just so you guys know, the study was out of 3,400 f- former NFL players. So that is a pretty big base. And of this study, there was a 30% higher likelihood that if you got a concussion, you're going to get limp dick. And of all the players, the people who have the side effects of this dysfunction are the players that had the most recorded concussions throughout their career. Mm. Ooh. So if you guys are getting into any physical sport that deals with concussions, soccer, hockey, football, or any type of fighting, martial arts, MMA, if you get a concussion, just remember, you're just not likely to get CTE. You're also likely not to be able to use your dick in your 50s. You can still use your dick if you have erectile dysfunction. You're just going to be put on medication and you're going to have to take those pretty blue pills. Well, that's that, that's that's Be what nice I meant. nice to people with ED. That, that's what I meant. They need love too. <laughs> no, but I'm just saying that's like your another. Brain gives up, and then your dick just fuck. <laughs> fuck. I well, you want to know the reason for this? You want okay. A possible explanation for this concussion associated symptom is that the disorder is related to a gland found in the base of the brain, which regulates hormone production. Psst. That makes sense. Now, by the way, this is just the first study, so this is not scientific, but the results were very obvious, and the science makes sense in terms of linking stuff. So I was like, yeah. Monty, did you ever get a concussion? Mm-mm. Okay, good. I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> I don't think I ever got a concussion. I had did soccer. Damn. But you're a woman, too. So your vagina will be sideways or something? <laughs> <laughs> I mean... <laughs> I mean, is it? Bro, I don't mm-hmm. think she's going to have a problem with I mean, my <laughs> bead fell off and I picked it back up. That's all. <laughs> like, if, 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 if her cooter is this wet now, just wait till she hits her 40s and 50s, bro. That mm. shit is going to be flowing. Word. Like, like how, would you, how would you explain your he vagina? He doesn't right? even... Wh- I, how would you explain your vagina? If it's a leak, uh, a faucet, a river... Or sh- the straight up the oceans. Where would you well, place your wetness? Uh, every female is not going to tell you that they shit is a leak. They going to automatically go with the ocean. But she's honest, so I'm going to trust her. Mm. And any bitch, and if ten out of ten women say, "Oh my, my any pussy's <laughs> my pussy," <laughs> continue with bitch it sticker. changed. No. I feel like it changes, and I feel like it's changed. I feel like. Okay, I feel like in like around the beginning of the year, from like maybe. January, maybe March, April, I was like a leak. Okay, where are you now? I'm like a. Can I see this? So you're the faucet. She's Fiji. I'm like a. I'm more than a drip. Before I was just like. She's Fiji, my nigga. I don't know. That's a drip? What the fuck? (laughs) I don't know. I don't know. It's it's bad. Like she's, sometimes she's I no. Fiji. Sometimes I have to. I do have to change my underwear periodically. Like sometimes I have to change my underwear like a couple times a day. Just but like imagine when you're forty, your shit is just going. You're gonna have to wear like three underwears a day. But it didn't. It it's, it's like off and on. Like it changes. Like sometimes it's. I mean, I During the don't have a dry right? coochie. During no, the summertime, this, right? This, this is summertime, right? It, it picked up, right? Oh yeah. So so but, when you're in your forties, it's just not gonna be a faucet flow it's gonna be a straight river flow you're just gonna be like oh, what am i gonna do you see a nice bald chocolate man walk by it's like, oh, it's like, oh. if i don't hit menopause <laughs> no but that's when women are their horniest that's when their pussy is flowing the most it's like their pussy is now one with nature at this point in time 
so experienced wow. and shit. I need, I need. So you're going literally become a river as we speak. You're going to be flowing. Oh my god, we are talking about. <laughs> Okay, getting uh, back to limp dick, guys. Just if you guys were worried about CTE, protect your head. Yes, protect your head. Wear your helmet. Yes. Put your seatbelt on. No, you fucking the helmets don't even be working. That's, no, the helmets that's... are actually worse because you have to look at it like this: Are you safer driving a car or or riding a motorcycle? A car, right? Uh, no, I'm it. saying when you drive, do you drive safer in a car or a motorcycle? A car. I drive safer on a motorcycle because if I fuck up, I'm more likely to get fucked up. That's how I view f- football with a helmet. If you're not wearing a helmet, you're going to protect your head more. If you're wearing a helmet, psychologically, oh, you think I'm safe, so I'm going to fuck you up with my head. That is a fact. You're going to be more safer on a motorcycle than in a car. Because you have more protection in a car. I'm not saying you're going to be reckless as fuck. Oh, okay. I was thinking about the car. I was thinking about it the opposite way. I was tripping. Yeah. And when you're in the car, you're just like. (laughs) Yeah, I don't give a fuck. Yeah. Motorcycle, you like, yo, 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 stay the fuck back, dog. Use your blinker, motherfucker. Yeah, I was thinking about it the opposite way. Get the fuck out of here. (laughs) Y'all, listen. Erectile dysfunction, we support you. You, you guys want to say anything else? Yo, I'm going to I'm going to say this. The moment I can't use my dick, I'm going to be a sad person, man. I'm being my dick. <laughs> no, but that's the point, limping bro. Limping on. But that's the point, bro. You're going to be limping. You're going to be beating a soft penis, bro. I don't give a fuck. That's so dep- Bro, you're going to get tired of it. Like, Listen, no, no. See, the difference between us is you beat dry, I beat with liquid. So my shit is going to be How is hard. your dick going to get hard if no it's blood It's not going to be It don't have to be hard, my bad. No it don't blood. Have to be hard. Wait, what? My shit still oh, no be blood is flowing. Down. Okay, y'all. Yeah. T- you're talking about an erect penis. He's talking about wet and dry dick. Y'all just confusing me <laughs> so bad. I don't even know what the fuck he's talking about. We're talking about limp. He dick. said you be dry. He be wet. You <laughs> just. I just don't know what's going on. I'm saying that. I, just to point this out, my you're outnumbered go- four to two, bro. I don't give a fuck, bro. How the fuck is y'all here beating dry? <laughs> <laughs> I need more numbers out here, bro. There's a lot of people out the here. The only person agreeing with you was the Planet Fitness co-worker. The worker. But why would you... I don't understand. Why would you beat your eye? I don't fucking know what's this guy. If you want to subscribe, just hit this bad boy up here, that big fat rhino. If you want the newest video, to the right. If you want the recommended, to the left. And then, of course, our personal dick, dick pic. Dick. Yep, right below. So thank you for joining us once again, and we hope to see you next week. So peace out. Peace.